welcome back to the channel I uh, hope you enjoyed our first episode so we've got a little bit in store for you this time we've got a whole lot of stuff in my shop here and it's starting to take over uh, but that's okay it'll all be worth it so we uh, we cover a lot here we've got leaks we fix leaks we've got insulation we get it in and we get an air condition not installed but we've got one here thank goodness because we need it so bad but we got a lot going on and we get some help with the insulation and I really appreciated that that really helped uh, speed things up so uh, thanks for joining us and enjoy But this time Lego. There's Alex crawling under Daddy's bed. And here's Racy's bed. Mommy and Daddy's bed. And this table. You got anything in that bathroom? No. Mm, no, haven't installed the shower yet, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Or the toilet. And then here's the sink, which Racy's in because she's taking a bath. Who is giving Racy a bath? Pages. Okay. And then here's the oven with two coffee cups on it. You get a closer view of that. There's the oven with coffee cups, very important. And then here's our Got bed. Paige, working hard on our logo. Yeah. Having any luck, buddy? Yeah. Good. I can't find any bushes though, so I just had to use some clouds and make them green. Cloud, green, cloud bushes. Yeah. Very good. Oh, look at what we got. Pioneer, mini split, 12,000 BTU. Um, hope it's big enough. Everyone says it will. Will work. We'll see though. Here's my marketplace purchase. Super excited. Two 30 gallon waste tanks. Black tanks, gray tanks, whatever you want to call them. I'm going to use one for a gray tank, one for a black tank. Pretty cool. It's going to hang down a little lower than I expected or really wanted. But for the price, couldn't beat it. They're exactly alike. 30 gallons, brand new. <laughs>
Mm, that works. Take it out. Uh, inside first for our main lights. Outside for uh, maybe an awning light or we'll have to mount LEDs out here. And then a rear light. So that's three switches. And then an outlet side. Does that work? Sound okay? Yeah, do we want to just, do we need an outlet there, you think? Yes. Okay. I mean, we can put it underneath the switches, however we want to do it. You know how our camper is now, where we have two outlets? That's really nice, so we can yeah. put a coffee maker and phones. That's true. Main split runs off the other. So it won't have an outlet. Mm -hmm. And it's going above the door here, right? Yep. Air conditioning. Can't wait. <laughs> things to destroy the generator box. Alex, come tell me what we just did to this box over here. What did we do to it, bud? We tore it. We tore it? Why did we tear it? Because we're building a camper back. Yeah, we're going to make it a little smaller and build it back. So we have more room in our bathroom to take a shower. Cause you boys get stinky and you gotta have a shower. So we're gonna take about 10 inches off of this. Shorten it up. Yeah. So we can have a little more room here. Right, take these off and this off. Yeah, we're gonna take it all off. Yeah. Then put it back. And take this off. We're going to take that off too? I don't know. I have to put it on. You think we should? Because it's. Because it has you no know, right here. Yeah. You know, right here. Yeah. You're going to use your drill and take that off? I can see it outside. You can. Goodness. Found a little hole, huh? Yeah. We might have to work on that. Just after the storm passed before I went to work 
and I found a few, I mean, very small leaks. Um, I, I almost wonder if we didn't have the wind we had with the hurricane, if we would have even had leaks. So yeah, I marked a few. So there's only three, three areas. The worst is the back corner. This is the low spot. And this is where all the water runs off on the outside. So not, I mean, it was surprising. I wish I would have had a leak. So we also purchased two sheets of insulation. Just wanted to see how it fits, how it looks. Uh, we got a one inch, it's the pink foam. It's got the pink panther on it. Kids are pretty excited about it. And then we got the one and a half inch for the ceiling. Uh, did a test fit on both of these and it's gonna work well. They fill the cavities very nicely. the generator box. Uh, I'm gonna try to cut some pieces. We cut it down and uh, screwed up on the, uh, on the corner here. A little too wide. We're gonna make up for it there with some aluminum because we had an issue with our wall. We've got it laid down. Laid, laid down. We've got it laid out. The problem is our layout puts the wall right in the middle of that vent. We can't have that. So we're probably going to have to move the wall in some to get us away from the bank. 